Hi guys. A quiet day. Um, today near the end of the uh, uh, old year and ready for the new year. So now that the builders are all gone for the holidays and left a mess, I'm going to see if I can move my um, pizza oven down here. So what I'm doing at the moment is just um, leveling the dirt and putting some concrete pavers down on which to build. I used um, fire bricks upstairs um, where I built the original one but I don't have enough fire bricks so we'll just use some concrete pavers and again we'll just cover them with a bit of dirt to try and protect them from the um, heat. Um, don't have any sand so I can't um, put this uh, on, on sand to level it so it's just painstakingly leveling it by hand um, in the um, uh, clay. Uh, I've got this far so far not looking quite level but um, that end part there is just to support the um, chimney so it doesn't need to be too level. Um, what have we got here? I think it's about 70 centimeters wide. That's a lot. Seventy centimeters wide, and seventy-seven uh, deep, and just over ninety um, to support the chimney. So that looks okay. Well, I'm going to have a rest, and then I'm going to start lugging these um, fire bricks um, from the um, front of the house down. The only um, bricks I've got are 50 mils um, deep are these fire bricks which are taller than the other ones which is going to create a problem for me. Oh well, I'll just have to stack these bricks and see how it goes. Uh, I'm going to put the port eccentrically so that the vortex comes out here and spins up and back to the back of the, um, to the stove I hope. Anyway bring more bricks down uh, it's looking like a bit of a um, jigsaw puzzle at the moment um, because of the different size and fire bricks I'm just having to um, try and stack everything and um, make gaps and fill them there's a big gap there so stuff some dirt or clay into those. Oh well, push on. Uh, I've got to backtrack a bit. I've got to put my um, secondary air channel in and then protect the uh, floor of the um, oven with some dirt because they're only concrete um, blocks or pavers rather than fire bricks. And I think that's uh, going to have to do a little bit of dirt tap down. Oh well, carry on. Well, it looks pretty awful, but um, I think it's uh, ready for a test fire anyway, so I can see where the leaks are. So I've had to move it to the right to create, create more um, space on top of the um, pavers that I laid. Um, I've got a uh, metal grill, this thing, the gas mate grill, cast iron grill to use as the um, roof to support a few fire bricks. And uh, I'm using the other um, gas mate um, uh, grill, well, grill um, to support the roof of the firebox. And unfortunately my chimney looks pretty wonky at the moment, but I don't think it will really affect the uh, draft that much. Time to put some wood in and see how it goes. Got some newspaper in there, light it, um, and a bit of kindling to see if the um, kindling catches a light. A bit of smoke coming out. 
not unexpected. I suspect there are lots of gaps here that I could pack with um, clay. No smoke up there yet. Now that the kindlings are light, sort of, uh, well, I'm going to put some more wood in. It's already going up the um, Venturi, up the port. Oh, it's smoking a bit badly at the moment. He probably needs more uh, newspaper. Fire is going a bit better. Probably need a bit more wood. This is what the uh, fire looks like with a bit of encouragement. Uh, could be better, I guess. So this is what the fire looks like at the moment. Everything's proceeding through the port. Did a little bit of smoke, not much. Fire coming up the riser, hitting the roof. So I think this will probably work for pizza. Okay. We need some more wood. It's only about a quarter full. Probably should be um, at least three quarters full. Then we get some really decent flame coming up the riser. And uh, should be able to cook our pizzas. Pizza time now. I'm going to start the fire up. Well, I started the fire up with a newspaper. Quarter past four in the afternoon. A little bit of smoke. I need to fill it with fire, I guess. Um, it's just newspaper with a bit of kindling. We're about 20 minutes into the fire now. I've just put some more wood on to um, get a bit hotter, but. I've just put some chicken and um, what else have I put in? Potatoes, I think. The oven's reading 88 at the side there, 229 at the top, 150, 175 on the bottom. So I think it's probably good enough for potatoes. Let me close the lid up. Fire's been going for about um, half an hour now. Currently smokeless. That's good. No smoke. No smoke here either. Let's have a look inside the firebox. Let's have a look at this fire. Oh, it's dying down a wee bit. Need some more wood. Shame. <clears throat> Oops, a bit hot here. Well, too hot. Let me get that around. And uh, inside the cooking chamber, oven. Let's have a look. 130 at the distal end. 230 at the left hand end. 245. 300 on the roof. 210 centigrade or Celsius at the um, the base, but less over this left hand side. Three twenty in the roof. Better close her up. 
Uh, looks like things are overcooking a really bit. Potatoes are done, chicken's a bit overdone, they didn't wash that. And the floor of the oven is now reaching 300 degrees Celsius, so... Uh, yeah, I'm just waiting for my guests to turn up. The plate currently is about 350 degrees. 326. Ooh, everything's puffing up nicely. I need to twist it around a bit, perhaps. Didn't have any um, semolina, so can't get the bread off the um, peel, so it's just sitting in there. Currently, um, the um, pizza tile or stone is about 350 degrees Celsius, so it's freaking hot. And uh, this pizza's got everything chucked on top. Once it's cooked up a bit, I'll be able to remove it from the um, peel. So the pizza's cooking now, I think. And we're getting 328 Celsius, 340 Celsius on the plate. At the rear, we're getting 261. At the distal side, 241. And at the top, can't see at the top, it's about 315. There's no flame anymore. So I used to have some flame. Up, coming out from the riser now it's just coals finished uh, cooking about um, half an hour ago and I can just feel the heat even from here so the whole thing's still radiating heat like um, a rocket mass heater is um, 144 degrees Celsius on the outside of the um, 120 degrees Celsius on the outside of the um, cranking. It's a bit hot, no wonder. <coughs> but the fire's finished, it's just coals inside. Okay, well, interesting. I still have to solve the fact that the uh, pizza stone broke again, um, probably because the um, cast iron plate that uh, is the roof of the firebox is um, buckling under the heat. How oh well, another time to fix that problem. Thanks for watching.